Can you tell us briefly what drew you to your character and was any part of the script adapted to you in your life? What drew me to this character in this piece was the fact that I feel like it uh, catered to such a broad demo of people, you know. Um, you know, there were some similarities uh, to my personal, you know, uh, uh, attributes as, a, uh, as an entertainer. Uh, I'd say the fact that he was kind of cool with the ladies, uh, very fly guy character. A lot of uh, a lot of that has to do with uh, uh, his job as a DJ. But uh, for me, as an entertainer, of course, you know, fans and 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 and, and, and having that following it was kind of you know I was kind of accustomed to that. Okay. Um, how did you prepare for the part? Can you tell us a little bit about your acting process? The acting process. One, I, I dealt with a uh, an acting coach, and uh, I kind of. And I asked myself, well, what would work for this character? I felt like the subtleties, you know, I felt like it would be in taking in the moments and, 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 and really emotionally releasing whatever is there. I had to build a backstory for my character because it's not, it's not able to play out throughout the entire film. You know, the fact that Daryl Williams, you know, takes on this responsibility to bodyguard a Don's daughter had to be for more than, for more than reason more than reasons for that were obvious because he asked him to. But, uh, you know, and, I, and my character kind of leads to the fact that, you know, if you had not been there for me uh, doing school or doing college, my father's dreams would have never come true. So if you need me right now, I'm here for you. You know, um, I built a backstory for him, you know, and, and part of that was the process of, of getting to know myself as Daryl Williams. Okay, cool. Um, okay, you have a lot of involvement with this film, acting, exec producing, and debuting your label, Us Records, U.S. Records. Uh, briefly tell us about all the different hats you're wearing on this project. A man of many jobs. You know, uh, this one gave me an opportunity to be associated with it as, as an executive producer, uh, as an artist uh, through the label, uh, introducing both of my artists, Rico Love and One Chance. Uh, but, you know, I just felt like, you know, take advantage of every opportunity possible to uh, uh, be creative. And uh, that's what it is, man. Okay. Um, you're quoted as saying, my love is music, but my mistress is acting. Do you <laughs> still feel that way? And if so, can you elaborate? Oh, man, I fell in love with acting a while ago. And uh, sometimes you, you truly feel like your mistress is your wife. You know, if, if we could do things the way they do them in the Middle East, I'd probably have two wives. You know, but uh, acting is definitely one of uh, one of the things that is, I'm going to love more and more and do and doing more. Uh, obviously, you know, with the success associated with music, I don't want to walk away from it. I have fans now. I'd hate to let them down, but I'm looking for more fans and uh, also for the fans that I've, I've gathered thus far to be a part of the process and grow. Okay, and um, briefly, can you just say a little bit um, about working with Chaz and Emmanuel? Okay. Working with Chaz was a pleasure, you know, a pioneer at this. You know, I'd say that he is the Don of Dons, you know, and the chemistry between me and Emmanuel Shrieky was just electrifying. It just jumps right off the jumps right off the screen. You know, I, I really didn't recognize it myself until after the premiere. You know, you get a sense that it's going to be there, but when you see the reaction of the people and you see the smiles, I look. I actually spent most of my time at the premiere looking at faces. And especially, particularly the, the couples that were there, they're looking back at each other, and you know, it was just beautiful, beautiful. Okay, that's cool. Well, I enjoyed it. I think it's a really fun Thank film. You.